Good morning, Sycamore Junior High, and welcome to Monday Morning Video Announcements. Before we start, could everyone please stand and face the flag, and we will begin with the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you very much. You may be seated. All right, this is our last week of the 2019 uh, school year. So we flip back and we come back again, it'll be 2020. So everyone have a great last week. Remember, we still have school. You got to follow rules and everything like that, okay? And make this last week and the last week of second quarter a very good week. All right, since it is Monday morning video announcements, we have the great and wonderful Mr. King with our students of the week and a special announcement. Good morning. Um, just want to make a quick announcement about our hallways and about lunchroom. Uh, remember, students, you have four minutes between each bell, and you have six minutes from the time the bell rings to get to your lunch. Starting today, we'll be out in the hallways helping you guys move along to either get outside or inside. So make sure that you are going to your lockers as individuals. If you're with a friend, the place to meet is either outside or inside, not at the locker. So you have six minutes. When we come back from break, we'll remind you a couple days, and then starting about January 9th, if you are not outside or inside at lunchtime, you will receive a lunch detention for being late. So make sure to start practicing getting out of class, getting what you need, getting to lunch between classes. If you got to go to your locker, go to your locker and move on, okay? We got to get there on time. So make sure we do that this week, and when we come back, continue it, and everything will be just fine. So, students of the week, sponsored by Chick fil A. We have our first student here. He's going to go ahead and introduce himself and let you know why he was nominated. My name is Stephen Coyne, and I was nominated by Mr. Wilkoff for being responsible. All right. Good job, bud. There is your gift card. Have a great day. My name is Evan Friedland, and I was nominated by Mrs. Jang for being responsible. All right. Good job. There is your gift card. Thank you, sir. My name is Bekroz. I was nominated being responsible by Ms. Falsford. All right, there you go. Congratulations to our students of the week. Like Mr. Harris said, we are still in school. Follow the rules. Uh, take this last week of the second quarter seriously. Get those grades up. Enjoy it, and we'll see you 2020. Wait, wear that plaid too, Mr. King. It is plaid day, so hopefully people representing in their plaid. I got a little, little plaid up here on the collar. All right, Showtime 2020 is coming up. All right, Sycamore Junior High will host a variety show, and we're looking for students to participate. If you have a special talent, talent and you would like that featured in the variety show, please attend a meeting during Flex Bell tomorrow. That's tomorrow, December 17th. We've had comedy skits, magicians, jugglers, instrumentalists, lip syncers, cheerleaders, dancing. We've had all of this stuff. All right, and the more variety, the better. All right, and the teachers will be participating in some kind of show-stealing number. All right, this meeting will be held Tuesday, that's tomorrow, during Flex, in the choir room. See Mrs. Stein or Mr. Callahan if you have any questions. All right. Monday morning announcements, we always do our Athletes of the Week, so we got Mr. DeJoy here with our Athletes of the Week. All right, thank you, Mr. Harris, and good morning, everyone. Um, first of all, before we talk about our Athletes of the Week, hey, a big shout-out to Coach Foley and the uh, junior high wrestling team as they won their own invitational over the weekend. So great job, what? guys. Woo, man, it was fantastic. Uh, they beat five other teams, and uh, they came out, and they did a great job wrestling. We want to thank all the volunteers the workers, just making an exceptional meet. So uh, thank you uh, very much, and again, congratulations. Okay, we have our seventh grade gold girls basketball player here today, Jordana Ronis Tobin. Good? Okay, great, okay. And uh, uh, Coach Frank said the following. Um, this season, uh, Jordana has made tremendous improvements in her jump shooting, fundamentals, ball handling skills, passing accuracy, court awareness, and overall understanding the game. Wow, that's, that's a lot. That's fantastic. And on defense, you've learned how to be in the right place at the right time, playing outstanding on the ball and gap defense. 
She is often asked to shut down the point guard on the opposing team. And she always plays at 100%, and she approaches every practice with the same intensity. When asked who deserved the Athlete of the Week honors, a team me wrote, Jordana is always paying attention and shows lots of hard work and determination during practices and games. From a coach's perspective, Jordana is the rare player that just gets it. She always listens and is extremely coachable. Uh, Jordana conveys a positive attitude and has an infectious smile. Ah, yes, okay. And is an absolute delight to coach. Wow, that's fantastic. Great job. Congratulations. And here is your certificate. There you go. Okay, next we have from the seventh grade boys gold basketball team, Andy Wee. How you doing, Andy? Good, how are you? Good, doing great, thank you. Um, okay, Coach Osborne said, and he said, Andy is a great basketball player and an even better young man. He has the skill and quickness which makes him an outstanding defensive player. Andy is always working hard, has no fear to mix it up with the bigger guys. Awesome, thank I like you. that, man. All right. Um, he will be a great asset to the seventh grade team this year and a key part in winning games. It is a joy and honor to coach a respectful, hardworking young man like Andy. Congrats on being the Athlete of the Week and all the hard work that you do. Andy, congratulations. Man, that's fantastic. And here's your certificate. All right. Have a great week, everybody. And back to Mr. Harris. Well, thank you, Coach DeJoy, and congratulations to our Athletes of the Week. Technology Club, you're going to be... December 18th, after school in the media center. The meeting will end at 4.30. Make sure you arrange for a ride home. All right, Coach DeJoy mentioned the wrestling team, so let's give them a big shout-out. Congratulations to the junior high wrestling team for their first-place finish at the Sycamore Duels over the weekend. Our second-place finish were Brendan Locks, Ryan Friedrich, and Angus Ellis. And our tournament champions, Bradley Creech. Cameron Messerschmidt, Kyle Burglar, Connor Burnett, and Jalen Davis. Great job. Way to bring home the hardware. Attention, all ski club and snowboard club members. Your passes are in. Please plan on picking them up today or tomorrow during Flex Bell in the back gym. Teachers, please allow them to pick, to pick up their passes and use that as their pass to enter class. Even if you picked up your pass from Perfect North, you will need to come and get your bus assignment and blue in info sheet for our January ski trips. And the last day for Homework Club is Wednesday, December 18th. That is all of our announcements. You guys have a great day. In case I don't see you on announcements again this week, you guys have a wonderful holiday. We'll see you back in 2020. Have a good week. We'll see you.